The NeoBar from Neotech Products has been successfully used to stabilize ET tubes in hospitals around the world for more than a decade. NeoBar owes its success to its unparalleled ease of use for securing ET tubes for neonatal to pediatric size patients. Here are a few key steps you should follow to achieve the best success with the NeoBar. Clean the skin. The cleaner and drier the skin, the better the NeoBar will adhere to it. Use a soft gauze moistened in plain water to clean the baby's skin. Caution. Alcohol and products containing alcohol solvents may interfere with the function of the NeoBar. Dry the skin thoroughly. Do not apply any skin barriers to ensure proper adhesion. Select the proper size NeoBar. There are many sizes of the NeoBar to accommodate everything from micro preemies to pediatric size patients. Selecting the proper size NeoBar is a very important step. The measuring strips in the package are color coded to the different NeoBar sizes. Place the end of the measuring strip at the midline of the nasal septum and measure the distance to the opening of the ear canal. The color that lands on the opening to the ear canal corresponds to the color of the appropriate size NeoBar. If the distance borders between two colors, use the larger size. Apply the NeoBar. The tabs on the NeoBar are made of hydrocolloid, which is very skin friendly. For proper adhesion, the hydrocolloid must be heated before application. To do this, either cup the NeoBar tabs in your hands for 60 seconds or hold them under the radiant heat warmer. The heat will activate the hydrocolloid and help the NeoBar adhere to the baby's skin. Once the tabs are warmed, remove the clear liners. Apply the tabs over the bony process in front of the ear, where the skin is less mobile. Position the NeoBar across the center of the mouth, between the upper and lower lips. Keep in mind that the NeoBar and ET tube should not come in contact with the lips. Cover the tabs with your fingers and hold for 60 seconds to ensure proper adhesion. To tape the ET tube, use white or cloth tape. Begin by wrapping the tape completely around the platform of the NeoBar. Then continue taping around both the platform and the ET tube. Leave a small courtesy tab to facilitate rewrapping. Neobar should be changed every five to seven days or sooner when clinically indicated. The Neobar can be used whether the baby is supine or prone. You can use positioning aids for additional comfort. You may see the tab lifting off the face. As long as the main body of the tab is firmly attached, there is no problem. Remove the Neobar. Saturate the tabs with water or saline, then gently peel back the tabs. In an emergency, simply cut the thin portion at the junction of the bar with blunt end scissors. For the latest recommendations on using the NeoBar and to learn about our new products, please visit our website at www.neotechproducts.com.